Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Adele and together we are going to have a lot of fun because I'm going to give you a good content to watch. I'm new on YouTube, as you can see I have already have zero subscribers and this is the first video that I'm publishing too. So I would really appreciate if you could show me some support by subscribing, by also giving a like to this video that you are watching right now and also guys turn on notification bell so you can always be updated on everything new that I'm going to post on my YouTube channel. So first of all let me represent a little bit myself. So as I told you my name is Adele and this is my YouTube channel called Adele Show TV. So here I'm going to post different content, mostly informative and educational. So I'm going to give you contents related to financials, how to earn money online, how to find jobs online, but other content and informatives too, like how to travel easily and places that you can travel or any other good content on how to grow on YouTube channel and how to start a YouTube channel and many other great information. So we are going to have together a lot of fun and I can promise to you that you are going to find here a lot of information that you probably haven't found in any other YouTube channel. So I really thank you for clicking on my video and watching it. So this is the first video that I'm publishing and it's a little bit long because I'm going to explain to you guys a very informative video. In fact, I'm going to give you a something in one video, something that you probably have seen in YouTube in separated videos. So videos that explain to you how you can earn money online, which is a big topic right now, right? It's becoming bigger and bigger as a topic because it creates great opportunities for everyone. So for all of those people who have fundamentally decided to continue working online, they have made the best decision of their life because working online can give you great benefits. One of them is that you can work in whatever time you want to. Also, you don't have any boss to give you orders and you have flexible hours and you can work at the comfort of your own home or you can travel in any place and still do your job perfectly with uh, not having any problem at all. So guys, starting off working online might not be very easily, but still it's not impossible. I'm pretty sure that everyone can do it. It doesn't matter what type of knowledge you know, how capable you are, if you have finished your university or your master degree. In fact, none of this matters because out there on the internet exist different type of jobs that everyone can do. So what did I came up as an idea to create as a first video on my YouTube channel was this little video that explains people what type of job they can do on different categories and in different websites. So this is, will be very informative so you can get all the right information. So in the end of this video, you will be capable of deciding what you will need to follow up for yourself and what will be the best decision for you too. So guys, you might have a knowledge, but you don't know how to use that knowledge for to benefit yourself and earn money online. So I'm going to show you some hostels over here that you are going to check them one by one, see all of the details, information, and in the end, you can decide which of one of them you can follow up for yourself. So guys, let me represent to you by this picture over here with some hustles that you can do online. We have YouTube, we have Redbubble, we have Skillshare, Fiverr, Amazon, and Shopify. So this is a small representation of what I'm going to discuss throughout this video. 
but this will be a very long detailed and informative video so prepare yourself to get all of the information that you need i would uh, tell you to not skip any part of this video because it will be harder for you to understand the main points that i will try to explain to you so you can understand and in the end you can be very capable of doing these jobs so guys let's start with the first one which i'm doing by myself too and I can guarantee that you can earn a lot of money by doing it. So you can earn money online by being a YouTuber. So as you can see, I have started my YouTube channel over here, but this is not my first time. This is another YouTube channel that I have just started, but I have already another channel, which is growing Bibker every day and I have reached to thousands of subscribers. But I have started this other YouTube channel over here so I can start this journey with you and also represent to you that growing on YouTube and also earning money from YouTube, it's not impossible at all. Plus, guys, I wanted to start something fresh and new. This is why I decided to open a new YouTube channel. So let's discuss a little bit about YouTube. As you know, YouTube every day is growing bigger and bigger. You can find a lot of creators on YouTube. You can find, probably you have, let's say, your favorite content creators on YouTube. The ones who play games, the ones who cook, uh, the ones who do funny things, the ones who do vlogs. So you mostly might have the favorite YouTuber by now that you follow up every day. Which means that YouTube has reached out to be one of those big platforms that you cannot live without it. It means that you always will have it in your phone and you will always use it for different reasons. To watch a YouTube video about listening to a music, watching a music video, watching a cook, a dish, watching vlogs watching funny videos, it doesn't matter. It can be different content because, as you know, uh, on YouTube you can find a rich content, different types of things. So guys, deciding to start with YouTube, first of all, you have to make up your mind in what type of category you want to be focusing to. Because if you click over here at YouTube, you can check out that you have different categories. You have music, you have gaming, you have news, you have sports, you have learning, you have fashion and beauty, but you have many more categories to subcategories sub and everything else that you can explore and check them by yourself. So first of all, when you decide to open your YouTube channel, you have to know and clarify to yourself what you're going to discuss on YouTube what you're going to publish to people. So mating up your mind on what type of content you're going to create is going to make your journey much easier. For example, before I started my journey on YouTube, I will brainstorm and um, take notes on everything that I would want it to create. And in the end, I also decided on one particular thing because I cannot post different videos which are not related to one another because it's going to be also confusing for my followers too. So I decided to only create one type of content which will be really good and that content should be related to each other so also people would identify me. So this YouTube channel is for this particular thing. So you know, for example, when you watch a cooking video, that you, that YouTube channel, it's only for cooking. And you know when you see um, a gaming video, that that YouTube channel that has posted that video, it's only about gaming. So this is how you separate you, the YouTube channels on YouTube and people categorize them. And they decide, for example, if they want to watch gaming or they want to watch funny videos or uh, educational videos and informative videos. 
So basically, in this way, they will also know what they want to subscribe. So guys, you also have to find your subscribers, the right subscribers, not the ones who would randomly subscribe to your YouTube channel and never watch your videos. So you should find uh, the right ones that would want to watch your videos. This is why it's really important to decide from the beginning on what type of niche you are going to concentrate your YouTube channel because you have to attract the right audience that will stick for you. You cannot post about gaming and then later on post about cooking and then later on about sports because it will be confusing for your audience and you're going to attract different subscribers which most of them will be confused and leave and never come back to watch your videos. So not to end up on that road, you have to clarify yourself with brainstorming, taking notes, checking out on what you are mostly passionate about. And then after you have decided on what type of category you want to concentrate, then you can continue opening your YouTube channel. So now we have the YouTube channel. Now we know what we are going to create. You should choose a really good name, which should be related to your personally, which can be your name, your personal name, or you can also put a nickname or you can put a something that is related to the content that you want to create. So be creative as much as you can when you decide to, to put a name to your YouTube channel and try not to change it oftenly because that name is going to be... I, this is the name that it's going to identify you. So will people want and are going to search up for you on YouTube that will have it easily, that will memorize your name easily. Also, the profile picture should be really simple, not to put too many elements on it. Just the name of your YouTube channel. So you can capitalize it or you can put an emoji or a figure or a picture which relates to the type of content that you're trying to put out, that, out there. So try to choose all of these elements on the right way. So guys, now that we have customized our YouTube channel and have put the right name, the right profile picture and everything else, we are ready to post our video. First, you should know some information about monetization on YouTube and how much you can earn and if a monetization is allowed in your country too. So you have to make some research before you go deeper into YouTube. So let's see a little bit together. This person over here has published how much YouTube pays you for 1,000 views in 2022. In fact, guys, if you go over to the YouTube studio over here, you can get some information on how much you need to um, have in order to activate activate the monetization. So how many? Uh, what are the criteria? Let's say that you have to accomplish. Uh, in order to monetize your YouTube channel. Monetization, it means earning money from YouTube, which is not hard at all. You just have to post as many videos as you can and get as many subscribers as you can. But still, you have to accomplish some criteria. So guys, you can earn eligible money. So this is legal money from YouTube. But in order to become part as a YouTube partner program, you need to meet some criteria. So the first one is to have 1000 subscribers. I know that most of you might think that this is impossible to reach out to 1000 subscribers, but I can guarantee that in half of a year, you can reach out to 1000 subscribers. If you put a lot of effort, you can reach to 1,000 subscribers in a very short period of time, so less than half of the year. You just need to put out there the right content and attract the right audience. Now, despite of having 1,000 subscribers, which is really important, another thing is to have 4,000 public watch hours. So as soon as you start publishing different videos, this element will be 
of not very hard to accomplish. You are going to check out that as many videos you post, you can reach out to 4,000 public watch hours in a very short period of time, in one month or two months. So this is, will not be hard at all to accomplish. The third one is two-step verification. You can do this very easily. You just have to activate the two-step verification, which YouTube requires it as a criteria in order to earn money from it. Even this one is not hard at all, and you can accomplish it too very easily. And the fourth one is to have zero active community guideline strikes. So for this one, you have to be very careful, guys, because if you get one strike, then I don't know if YouTube will allow you anymore to get money from it. But if you get three strikes, your YouTube channel is going to be deleted. You can get strikes when you copyright others' uh, videos. So you get the videos and you don't change them, you don't edit them, and you just publish them as they are and you will get a strike from YouTube directly. Most of the time they will give you like a warning to delete the video, not directly to give you a strike. But you have to be careful not to go to the strikes. Because if you get many strikes, then earning money from YouTube will be difficult. So try to be unique. Try not to steal um, others' videos and create your own videos, your own content, your unique content. Because people love it. They love to see new and fresh things, not things repeatedly. So these are the fourth criteria that you have to meet in order to start earning money and turn on the monetization on YouTube. Once you turn on the monetization, now we can go on with the information on how much YouTube pays you for 1000 views in 2022. So let's check out a little bit together over here. So guys, first of all, before we dig in into this, you have to know that um, things are always changing and the numbers always change. So this information might be right now, but might change later on. So you should always keep yourself updated and check out how much YouTube can pay you on different years. Because even though this might be valuable in 2022, might not be on 2023 or in 2024 so you should always check out so let's see a little bit over here we have different niches and the payments that people can get for 1000 views in this type of niches so the first one is making money online and if you make this type of videos you can earn out to 40 dollars for 1000 of views in your video if you post about finance videos, you're going to get $12.35 per 1,000 of views. If you post about social media tips, then you can get $7.55 per 1,000 1, of views. If you post about cooking, then you can earn up to $7.20 per 1,000 of views. If you post videos about tech, then you can earn $6.50 per 1,000 of views. If you post about fitness and health, then you can earn up to $4. If you post about photography plus videos, you can earn up again $4.39. If you post about self-improvement, you can earn to $3, vlogs $2, music $2, beauty $1, and parenting $1. Now, once again, guys, do not take this 100% into consideration because uh, it not always depends on the views, the money that you are going to earn on YouTube because there are always ads and other sponsors and collaborations too, which I will talk about a little bit later on by showing you an example of a YouTuber on earning money on using YouTube itself. So guys, there were also 
the niches over here that you can check out by yourself and see which one is the mostly high paid. So make money online niche, it's the one that stays on the top right now that it's mostly paid, but you also have finance, social medias, cooking and tech, which are mostly paid on YouTube. So watching this type of niches, you can also get like an inspiration on what you type of videos you can create yourself too and focusing because that's important when you decide to start the road on YouTube deciding what type of niche you have to follow up so check out a little bit these niches and how much they can um, make you earn so in this way you'll have it much easier now guys as I told you I wanted to show you um, a real youtuber out there who is making money with youtube and he is showing how much he's making by having two youtube channels so let's see a little bit how much he got paid with 1 million subscribers right now this person has reached more subscribers but he has made this video when he reached all to 1 million and as you can see this is a review and catch up of 2019 youtube so we have over here the first YouTube channel in which he made $1 million. While on the second YouTube channel, he has reached out to 170 thousands of dollars. He also had a program sales in which he made 500 thousands of dollars. He also had sponsorships in which he made for me 50 thousands of dollars and also affiliate marketing in which he produced forty thousands of dollars with it now guys i need you to be focusing on something over here something that i wanted to spot to you and make it obvious when we say we are going to earn money from youtube of course i'm talking about monetization and referring to it but when you reach out to have a lot of subscribers, like this person that has reached out in 2019 to have 1 million of subscribers, he did not only use YouTube to create content and get money from the views, but it also have used for program sales, sponsorships and affiliate marketing. So you can use YouTube for other things too that can make you earn a lot of money. YouTube is a big platform out there. And if you reach out also to get, for example, 1,000 of views or 2,000 of views on your videos, that's a big achievement because those 2,000 of people are watching your video. And in that video, you can sponsor or you can post an affiliate marketing link on the description and you can get the help of them to click on that affiliate link and make you receive money. Also, you can create um, an online store with Shopify or you can create an online store for print on demand and you can sponsor it on your own YouTube channel that can make you generate a lot of money. So basically, guys, what I'm trying to say is that YouTube can open to you a lot of doors, other doors that can give you profits too. So not only earning money with monetization, but in other ways too. So guys, if we go over to this person over here, we're going to check out that he has become very popular. He has reached out from 2019 to 2022 to 4 million of subscribers, which is a big achievement. It means that in two years, he has reached out at least three millions of subscribers so three plus more million subscribers you can check out that most of his videos have millions of views which means that he has generated a lot of money and you can check out that his types of videos are only in one type of niche which is finance niche so he's concentrating on that niche and it only makes and talks about it which has made it more obvious uh, that this person has reached the right audience that has followed him for so many years and also has reached out to where he is. Now he can sponsor, he can do other things 
and um, can have a lot of money from it. So he doesn't only get money from YouTube, but he also generates money with affiliate marketing, sponsorships, collaborations, and many more. He can also be an influencer if he, if he wants to because he has 4 million of subscribers. Now, I also have another YouTuber over here called Catherine Manning. And we can see a little bit how much YouTube has paid her with 300,000 of subscribers in 2020. And you can check out over here together the number, which is really big. So 88,000 of dollars. That's... That's a lot of money, in fact. We can understand by it that this person um, has really achieved to earn a lot of money and it explains mostly why you should be focusing on YouTube. Because you can be just like these people over here and earn a lot. Let's see a little bit the type of content that Catherine creates. So basically, she posts different videos about her lifestyle, also how she has started with YouTube. She gives tips, informative and educational videos. And with these types of videos, she has reached out to get a lot of views, which has made her earn money from YouTube too. But I'm pretty sure that Catherine is using also YouTube to promote uh, her other things. So you, for example, you can check out over here at the description box in which she says, shop my products. So as you can see, she has opened her online store in which she shares her product with her fans. And probably she has other stuff too that she promotes on her other videos, which means that she's using her big platform of YouTube to earn money by other things too. So guys, these were the YouTubers that I wanted to show you. Now let's get to the another point, which is how to turn on the monetization on YouTube. So let's say that now you have fulfilled the criteria that all of those four criteria that I told you before, and now you need to turn on the monetization. So first of all, you have to sign in to YouTube Studio. In the left menu, you have the monetization, and there you should click on it. Then click the Memberships tab, and this tab will only surface if your channel is eligible, which means that if your channel accomplishes the four criteria, then you can start turning on the membership of monetization. Then you are going to click get started and follow the on-screen um, instructions that YouTube has created for you to follow up and monetize your YouTube channel and start earning money per each view that you have got on your YouTube. Now guys, you should not only know about monetization, but also for CPM, which stands for cost per mile. Cost per mile is a paid advertising option where companies pay a price for every 1000 impression an ad receives. An impression refers to when someone sees a campaign on social media, the search engines, or another marketing platform. So before going into deeper on earning money on YouTube, you should get information about monetization, but also cost per mile. And guys, you should also check out what are the top countries with highest CPM. Let's see them together over here. So in the first place states Norway, which is with a CPM rate $43. We have in the second place Germany, which gets the CPM rate $38. And then we have Moldova with $29, Algeria with $24, South Korea with $17, Sweden $80, Finland $40, United Kingdom $30, Canada $30, and United States $30. Uh, $30. It means that Norway stays in the first 
place of top 10 countries with highest YouTube CPM. If by chance you are from Norway, congratulations. So guys, this was the whole information that I wanted to give you about starting up with YouTube. It's not hard, it's easy, and you can do it. Now let's leave YouTube and let's go on to another way that you can make money online, which is one of my favorite websites out there, Amazon itself. So you probably have heard about Amazon since you were a kid because it's been around for a very long time. Everyone has ordered in their lifetime once on Amazon a product, at least once, because I don't want to say more than once. <laughs> So we have many times tried Amazon ad, has never failed us. It is one of the best online shopping websites that exist out there. They have a perfect system, a perfect service, a perfect customer service and everything else that everyone needs. And also their products are different. They have basically everything. If you go over to the categories over here, you can see that they have digital content and devices and they also have electronics, computers, smart home, art and crafts, programs and features and many more. So basically they have everything on their store, which means that everyone that goes over to Amazon.com for sure it's going to find something that they would like. So guys, I'm here on Amazon because I want to show you that you can earn money by using Amazon. And if you're wondering to yourself how you can do so, I'm going to show you right away. So as you can see, here we are at the official page of Amazon.com. Here you are not going to find anything, in fact. This is only their homepage in which you can come over and you can shop everything that you want to. But if you go over to Google and search up for Amazon seller, and then you're going to find this website called Amazon uh, Seller Central Amazon.com. So this is basically the official page in which Amazon has created for everyone that wants to become part of their team and work as a seller on Amazon. So if you go over to sellercentral.amazon.com, here you're going to find that you can become part of Amazon as a seller and you can sell their products too. So let's see a little bit the information over here. Start selling with Amazon, the fastest growing and preferred acquisition channel for over half our multi-channel sellers. Here you will have also all of the information that you will need to know. Now, guys, this is not 100% free. You have to pay some money, in fact, to become part of this. But the pricing sections, it's not that um, expensive. It's really good, in fact. And I'm going to go later on to that part and also show it to you that um, it's not that expensive and it's affordable by everyone who wants to start selling on Amazon. So guys, being part of Amazon team can be one of the best choices if you want to sell something online because Amazon brand, it's a big brand and his name speaks itself. You don't have to advertise Amazon. Amazon can be advertised herself because it has a big name for many years. Everyone knows it. And when you say that you are selling a product from Amazon, it's going to be 100% simpler for you to sell their product while taking from another brand which is not very well known. And it will take you more effort and more... Uh, techniques to sell that product. So in order to start with Amazon Seller Central, you have to create your Amazon account by clicking over here. And then you just have to put your name, email, password, re-enter the password and click next. Putting all of the details 
and then creating your online store it's very easily now guys let's talk a little bit about the amazon private label so private labels are products that are manufactured by a third-party manufacturer or a company and then sold to another company to brand, market and sell under their own brand name or label. So this is basically what we are going to do on Amazon. We are going to do the Amazon private label. We are the third-party manufacturer so, and we are going to get uh, the product from another company and name it with our own brand name and then sell it so basically we're just a third party let me explain a little bit better for it first of all let's see here how to get started with private label which is the process here you can find some explanation, but I wanted to explain it better th with this figure over here. So follow me up, guys. This is the private label product process. So when you become part of Amazon, you should know this process because it takes some time and you should have information about it. So first of all, is the product made and packaged. Then it will paste to the labeled and palleted. This is the part where you are going to put the brand name or the name of the brand that you are going to create. So you have the product, but you have to put a name to it. So you can put whatever name you want and make it yours, that product. And then it's going to transport it to port. It's going to be shipped from China to United States, which will take you one month or two months. After that, it's going to be transported from port to freight forwarder. Now here, guys, it's going to get to the FF Moves inventory to Amazon warehouse. Now for those who have never heard about the Amazon warehouse, this is how it looks. Here is where your product will stay and get storage, their own storage. So when products are going to be ordered, they will be packaged and delivered to the customer. So guys, if your product, it will stay for a very long time on Amazon Warehouse, it can get a fee. If you check out over here on Amazon fees, you can get more information for it. So this is a screenshot that I took about the fee of each product if it stays too long on the Amazon Warehouse. As you can see, you can have fees for books, music, videos, DVDs, video games, software and computer games, and all other products lines. So with this information, you should know that you should not leave for a very long time your products on Amazon Warehouse, but sell them as soon as you can. And then uh, as soon as someone orders the product, Amazon fulfills customer orders and you are going to get the payment. So this is how it works and functions. So guys, to start selling with Amazon, you have to go to the pricing section and help the look of all of these options over here and choose the right plan for you. Trust me, that's not very expensive compared to how much you are going to get uh, paid with Amazon. So guys, let's leave over here Amazon and let's pass to another way that you can get paid online which is another favorite of mine called Redbubble. Now, what is Redbubble and how we can use it in order to make money? For those who have never heard about Redbubble, it's basically a print-on-demand website. Now, what is print-on-demand? Print-on-demand is a process where you work with a third-party supplier of white-label products to customize items and sell them on a pre-order basis. Print-on-demand products are created only when the item has been ordered by a customer, meaning you don't need to have a budget set aside to buy large amounts of stock. So you don't need to get a stock. You only have your online store, you have the products over there. And once the person or the customer orders the products, you can create it and give it to them immediately. 
So I will show you how you can do this. So first of all, let's go over to Canva, which is my favorite design website that you can use it. And here you are going to create the print on demand t-shirts. For example, I can create this very beautiful over here design with flowers. Now what I will have to do after I have created my design, I just have to click on share and download design to my computer. Now have in mind that Canva is not 100% for free, so you have to download it um, and get one of the plans. Now guys, after you have created your design, what you'll have to do is go over to Redbubble and put it to the clothes that you're going to create. It's very, very simple, in fact. So in order to become part of Redbubble and sell, you have to click on sell your art and here you can get more information. How Redbubble works. You upload your designs to products in your shop so basically this design that we created here together which is a simple design you can create other designs to more beautiful ones i just created that design for a more a faster way of creating for example i can create this design with this cat and i can put a heart behind it just to make it look more uh, gorgeous so I know that there are a lot of people out there who love, um, let's say, cats. So I think there will be a lot of people who would love this type of uh, picture. So I can make it like this. And I can also put here another picture of a cat. I can make a cat like this. And I can also change the color of the heart and I can make a, a design like this. So basically I created a design that I can download it and now I can go over to Redbubble, join the Redbubble as an artist or as, as an artist and then I can custom my designs and customers find the pr and purchase products they love, products are produced immediately as i told you the products are only produced only when the customers orders that customer gets the products and you can get paid for what you did which was basically something a simple thing so a simple design so this is how it works and you can join for completely for free so guys, you can also check out on a Google for Redbubble earnings and you can see how much you can get paid for only one design to be sold. Might not be the best payment that you have ever seen. Uh, it means that you're going to earn like 54 cents, but still it's a lot when you think that you don't have to do a lot of work by creating those designs. Now guys, I have another way that you can work online and get paid, which is Fiverr. Now you probably might have heard a lot of the word freelancer, being free and working whenever you want to. It's basically the concept of working online, being a freelancer, free, having the freedom to choose whatever job you want to, to Put the payment you want to for yourself. Now, different from the other options that I have told you throughout this video, being a freelancer means that you can put whatever price you want to, to yourself. And this is what I really love about Fiverr. If you go over to Fiverr, you're going to see a lot of different jobs that you can take and a lot of people working on Fiverr. And those people just have the right skills and they have participated on Fiverr and they have their own customers, they have their own prices and packages that they have created. So basically, you have the freedom to do whatever you want to. You can create like a small business on Fiverr that you can do your job, spread your talent and put whatever price you want to yourself. You don't have basically anyone to tell you what type 
of uh, things you have to do, create, or how much you will get paid in the end. So guys, let's have a look on what you can do on Fiverr. Let's see over here. We have all of the options. First of all, let's have a look to the popular professional services. You have logo designs, you have WordPress, you have voiceover, you have CAO, you have illustration, you have translation, and many more. So guys, let's explore the marketplace. You can be a graphic and design. So graphic designs over here. You can be about a minimalist local designs, architecture and interior designs, website designs, and other options that you can check out over here. Despite graphic and design, you also have digital marketing, which is because becoming and growing bigger this day as a type of job that is highly paid too. You can become a CAO, a social media marketer, video marketing, music promotion, social media advertising, e-commerce marketing and many more. You also have writing and translation, you can do articles and blog posts, translation, ghostwriting, proofreading and editing, resume writing, website content you can do video and an animation you can do music and audio programming and tech business lifestyle and data too if you go over to lifestyle you have math tutoring game coaching trip plans trip plans might be much easier than the other options too you have FIFA coaching, you have greeting cards, videos, modeling and acting, arts and crafts, and life coaching too. So guys, you have different types of jobs from the most easiest one to the difficult one, which is programming and tech, obviously. So if you have, by chance, any knowledge in any type of categories, that you can find on Fiverr, then I would totally recommend to you to just open an account as a freelancer on Fiverr and you can work over here. You can put the price on yourself on and also what time you will want to work, how much you will want to work and how much you want to earn. So this was about Fiverr and also being a freelancer. Now, guys, let's go over to Skillshare, which is another way of earning money on uh, internet, working on internet and earning money. Now, for this one, in fact, it will be a little bit difficult and not an option for everyone. But still, I wanted to give it to you and represent it because I know there might be people out there who don't have any idea that Skillshare exists and might be a great option for them to choose it to earn money. So guys, basically on Skillshare, you can explore different courses that people can check out. They can learn creative skills, uh, they can get informative uh, and inspirational online courses for uh, music, drowning and painting, marketing, animation, social media, for design, for creative writing, for digital illustration, for film and video, for crafts, freelance and entrepreneurship, graphic design, photography and productivity. It means that you are going to find a bunch of different online courses here that every teacher gives it and they get paid for doing that. So guys, if you have understood, you are going to become a teacher on Skillshare. So if by chance you have knowledge on any of these categories over here on music, drowning, marketing or any other type of things listed over here, then I will totally recommend to you to open uh, your account on Skillshare as a teacher and start working immediately because you can earn a lot of money. Why having that knowledge only for yourself? Well, you can share it with others and you can get paid for doing that. So guys, the only thing that you will have to do is just to click on become a teacher. You can apply over here, which is 
not um, difficult at all of course you will have to accomplish some of their requirements and that's all how teaching works so first of all you have to create your first class film your skillshare class and publish it with their easy class upload tool they will provide to you with help every step of the way Grow your following. There are millions of members learning on Skillshare. They will show you how to build your presence on Skillshare community and beyond. You will start earning. The, you will be paid monthly for every member who watches your classes. And top earning, uh, top earning teachers can reach out to $100,000 per year. That's a big number for only publishing your knowledge on Skillshare, right? So what I'm trying to say, guys, is that you can spread knowledge and you can get paid for doing that. So become part of Skillshare, apply to become a teacher and don't lose this amazing opportunity of getting paid with big money just for being an online teacher. Now let's get to another topic or let's say another way of earning money online which is one of my favorites and is becoming bigger and everyone is finally understanding its worth. I'm referring to drop shipping. Drop shipping finally has all the attention that probably never had before. So everyone has understood right now the potential that dropshipping holds that can really change your life because it doesn't need a lot of money, can make you a businessman and also you can grow bigger and earn a lot of money from it. Basically, guys, this is creating a business by having zero money on your pocket. Many people will spend and invest a lot of time and money to create a business while with dropshipping you just only to invest some a little bit of effort, a little bit of time and a small amount of money and that's all. Now when we talk about dropshipping the first thing that pops up to your mind is Shopify which is becoming bigger and bigger every day. There exist a lot of other dropshipping websites out there, in fact, that you can use and for sure feel free to use whatever you want to. But I would totally recommend to use Shopify because everyone is using it. Famous people like uh, Kylie Jenner and also Mr. Beast, a famous YouTuber, are using Shopify to promote their brands. Um... What you will have to do as soon as you come over to Shopify, first of all, inform yourself with some information. What is Shopify, first of all? Shopify is a complete commerce platform that lets you start, grow and manage a business. This is what I practically told you guys. You are going to become a businesser with uh, Shopify. It's something that you can reach it out with a little bit of effort you don't have to pay a lot of money in order to open your own business with shopify you can create and customize an online store sell in multiple places including web mobile social media online marketplace brick and mortar locations and pop-up shops manage products inventory payments and shipping Shopify is completely cloud-based and hosted, which means you don't have to worry about upgrading or maintaining software or web service. This gives you the flexibility to access and run your business from almost anywhere, including your mobile device too. I love all of the features and benefits that Shopify offers and also the prices. They also give you a free trial that you can get it immediately. You can try it for three days for free. Check out if it likes you. If not, then you can cancel it and forget about it. 
But trust me that everyone is working with Shopify and it's happy with it. So even though you're going to try it out for three days for free, it will guarantee that you will like it and you will have to stay and use it and open your business. Now let me tell you how it works. First of all, let's get to Shopify and you just have to click on start free trial after you have entered your email address. You will create your online store, which is pretty simple because they give you customizable templates, free website designs to launch your store quickly. You will have everything in one place and Shopify is going to take care of everything from marketing and payments to secure transactions and shipping to a safe and efficient platform. So guys, after you have created your online store with Shopify, now you have to find the products that you want to sell on Shopify. And I will totally recommend to you to go over to AliExpress. Here you can find products with half of the prices that you will find in other stores. If we go over to Google and search for top winning products to sell on Shopify, you're going to see that travel accessories, health and beauty products, eco-friendly products, vegan products, pet accessories, sports and fitness products, home and garden products, home office equipment are the best ones as a choice. So you can search up for this type of products on AliExpress. Decide which one you are going to continue using it and then in the end, well, you are going to order them and sell them with a double price on your shop. For example, if, uh, let's say, a product from AliExpress costs only $1, you can order that product and you can sell it for $20 to your online store on Shopify and it's going to have your um, the name of your brand. So this is how it's function and I really like it. It's simple and fast. Now guys, you can also go over to TikTok, which is growing bigger as a platform and everyone is using it for promotion. You can check out Amazon Find as a hashtag on TikTok and you can check out a lot of videos with different products from Amazon. What you'll have to do is just pay a little bit of attention. Uh, what mostly people are liking it and are ordering so what you'll have to do is just go over to aliexpress and order that product and then go over to shopify and put over there the product and as soon as people are going to order it aliexpress is going to think about shipping the delivery and customer services and everything else you just need to only put the products on your shop and take care of your online store and also to promote your products. To promote your products, I would recommend to you to become part of TikTok and post videos about uh, your uh, equipment or products that you're going to sell on your online store and you're going to get a lot of attention from people. Trust me when I say that because I've seen a lot of videos on TikTok for this type of products and then get a lot of attention easily. Find unique products, something that not everyone is having and try to find those type of products that are not in Walmart or Amazon because if people watch the product and they find it on Amazon and that means that you will never sell your products. Because people trust more Amazon, it's a big brand and has a bigger name and of course they will prefer more to get uh, things on Amazon than from an online store who has just started. So try to find those type of products which are not easily found in every store, in every big store that exists out there. Also, guys, you should find products which fulfill the need of people. So they are required, people need those products, they are very helpful, they make their lives easier. So in this way, your product is going to be sold faster. 
it should be small and um, carried on in every place. So you just have to make a lot of research when you decide for the product that you're going to sell on your online store. And you need to be focused only in one particular uh, niche on your store. So do not go from electronics and then to beauty and makeup because it will be confusing for people on what you're trying to sell. So try to create a good store. Uh, make and make use of as many templates as you can to attract the attention of the people with the help of Shopify, which will only cost you one dollar per month. A lot of people pay hundreds and thousands of dollars to create their business. Well, with Shopify, you can do it with only one dollar per month. Guys, we have come to the end of this video, and I would like to thank you first of all for watching it. I've covered up a lot of different ways that you can work online. Of course, there exist other ways too that you can check out by yourself. And I will continue posting different videos, informative videos that you have to know before uh, going over to um, internet, let's say, and try to become part of it. I know it's not easy, but... You can try it out these types of jobs that I shared with you and decide which is the best one for you to work as a YouTuber, to work as a, 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 a print-on-demand person in Redbubble, as an Amazon seller, on Fiverr as a freelancer, on Skillshare as a teacher or on Shopify with dropshipping. So you can decide on whatever thing that you want to and in the end you will understand that becoming part of this type of category it's not that hard and can be really fun and easily achieved. Thank you guys for watching. Please show us some support by subscribing. I would really appreciate it. As you can see, I have zero subscribers and I would really love to reach out to even more subscribers out there. And also, guys, I would appreciate if you could give a like and thank you for staying with me till the end of this video and see you on my other videos.